Hi everyone, I am outside in the snow today and for the uh, Preppers series I wanted to talk to you about car kits and bug out bags and I actually have an older video on winter car kits. I'll link it down in the description box um, and, but it is specifically designed more for cold weather so um, if you are in a place like me that gets snow and cold weather, then make sure to go and take a look at that because it's more detailed than what I'm going to tell you right now. But a car kit is designed for if you are trying to get home and something gets in your way. Um, say for instance, you're on your way home from work and you know something's really bad has happened in your community you know maybe some sort of storm or whatever and you can't get through maybe the roads are blocked or who knows what a car kit will have stuff in it that um, you may need stuff that you put in yourself that you designed for yourself um, but along with your car kit you should always keep certain things in your vehicle anyways uh, maybe a small tool kit electrical tape, a flashlight, things like that in case there were to be something wrong with your vehicle that you could possibly fix right then and there. Um, here in the north, uh, most of us carry jumper cables. So um, yeah, that's something to think about as well. But um, in my car kit, it depends on the season as to what's in there. Like this time of year, there's no water in there because the water would, would freeze pretty much overnight or within a day or two. But in this, the summer and the other um, months of the year, I keep water in my car at all times. Uh, right now I have a heavy wool blanket. It's not in, in the kit itself, but it's in my car. I have a tarp. And um, those are things you need to think about. Like what if you were stuck in your vehicle? for a few hours what if it wasn't running um, you know what if you just you just never know so you might want to put a little bit of food in there you might if it's cold out you might want to put an extra pair of gloves or a hat um, think about things that you may need extra medication um, it, it's stuff like that that could get you through a temporary crisis and with a bug out bag that's um, kind of the same idea but a different purpose now a bug out bag or a go bag is designed for you to keep at home in case you have to leave your home immediately um, some disasters we have warnings of like a hurricane for instance you would have more time to gather more stuff before you had to leave or evacuate but there are other disasters where it might be um, you only get a few minutes so you want to pack stuff in that bag that you could use or need on the road until you get back home um, people design bags differently. I have a friend that designs a bag specifically for a house fire. Now that's not necessarily um, her only bag, uh, but she worries about ho house fires because they're pretty prevalent in her area. And so she has a bag that has um, important papers and stuff like that in there so if need be in the middle of the night if she had to she could just grab it and run out the door but a bug out bag you might have extra clothing and, and snacks and water and medication and um, maybe comfort items for your kids if, you know design their own bags for them and that's that's what you need to think of when you're thinking of a go bag. Think about things you would really want to have or need if you only had a few minutes to get out the door. And there's a lot of disasters where that could happen. Um, a wildfire, for instance, that maybe isn't coming towards your house, but the wind shifted and all of a sudden it is. You know, so I have a video on that as well. It's a very basic video for a basic go bag, but I recorded it in hopes that it would give you ideas because everybody's gonna 
pack something different. I mean, there are items that all of us would and should pack, but then, you know, each person is unique and their circumstances are unique. So you're going to do something a little different than maybe your neighbor would. But I encourage you to watch that video and I'll have a link for that as well down in um, the description box. Um, I hope this has been somewhat informative to you guys. Uh, let me know down in comments if you have a go bag, a car kit, what you all put in it. Um, it'd be great because people really read those comments and it's helpful to other people. So um, I hope you guys are staying warm. I hope it's sunny and beautiful wherever you are. Anyhow, thanks for watching the video and thumbs up and subscribe and all that good stuff. It was nice talking to you, and you take care.